Say whenever and then I'll wait a couple seconds. Whenever, wait a couple seconds. Okay. <laughs> we are on our way to Indianapolis from Terre Haute. It's about an hour and a half away. And the reason that we're driving so far to get something to eat is because we're going to the best Asian restaurant in the state of Indiana. Possibly. I don't know. It's definitely one of the best. It's worth the drive. It's called Egg Roll Number One Pho Number One. It's a Vietnamese and Chinese restaurant. It's really great. We're almost there. And we'll get some food and see what you all think on Hungry Hoshans. <laughs> spring rolls to start with. They are the best. Um, this was our total. As you can see, $22.64 for all of our food. And let's give it a shot. Dig in, see how it tastes. You can see the shrimp inside. You can see all of the fresh, healthy veggies. Mmm, it's just so good. Excellent. The sauce is, um, I don't know, it's sweet and wonderful, isn't it? We think they're really the best, aren't they? All kinds of stuff in there, right? Mm -hmm. mm, delicious, the best we've had. So, we got the pho, and it's a, like a rare beef that we like in it. And, uh, if you like fun, it's amazing. <laughs> it's our favorite, right, Matt? How would you describe it? The greatest thing ever. They, they really don't understand. They Thumbs think up. that as long as they're saying you're like seven, they go ahead and bring it up. I can smell it. It's got a. Well, now I can smell the lime. It smells great. The bean sprouts. What's this? Do you remember what this is called? It's, is it? It's got a. Is it mint? Mint. It, t it smells like spearmint or mint, some sort of mint. Um, did you want any? This? Not right now. To start with the uh, freshness of the spring roll with the sweetness of the sauce on there and then come to the pho that is just incredibly rich in taste. It's uh, You just want to drink all of the broth because it's just so amazing. This is the pad thai. I know it is not Vietnamese and it is not Chinese, but we've had it before and it is one of the best pad thais I've had. They didn't give me any lime though. Is there any lime left on yours? Thank you. There's carrots in there. Yeah. Maybe green onions or something. Whatever this is. 
Green onion, I think. It doesn't need much because it's just really good on its own. I don't need more lime. Like that was the last one we had. I needed more lime because it just needed some sort of, you know, more flavor. This does not look the best that I've ever had. It's so good. Thinking about it, I get it. I guess I just don't see what she. You would think. She's, she's been, she's been, this has been the go to person all that. You'd think that it'd be a. You'd think that you'd have to go to a fancy restaurant. You'd think that you'd need to go to a fancy restaurant to get food like this. And this is just a tiny little place where tons of people go to eat because it's so good and it's such a great value. So. $22 for all this. Great. What do you think, Jody? Oh, man. It's the best I've ever had. I think it's the best. Well, okay. We've been to a couple places probably in Vegas that may top this little joint here in Indianapolis but uh, people all over the place here in Indianapolis you ask them where to go everybody goes here they're constantly busy um, the food is exceptional every time when you say it's pretty good it's excellent so you wouldn't think that a Chinese and Vietnamese restaurant that they don't, it's not fusion. It's Chinese food and Vietnamese food and some Thai food. Um, you wouldn't think that it'd be that great. It's it's excellent, so. And we're right next door to a White Castle and across from a Steak and Shake, a Pizza Hut, McDonald's. And a Firehouse Subs. Mm-hmm. Don't go to those. Eat here. Eat here. It's so good. You'll love it. Does that wrap it up for this one? I'm so yep. full. I'm ready for a nap. Can't take a nap. Can't take a Got nap. Things Got to do. Things to do on our way to our next adventure. Thanks for watching. Hungry Oceans. Bye.